Hello everybody, my name is the one who eats lemons and welcome to my playthrough of Dying Light. This is a game I know very little about, I've never played it. Uh, I know it's some sort of first person zombie apocalyptic game, which sounds very intriguing because first person and parkour and zombie, I think these are elements that have never been joined together before. So uh, beyond that, I know that there's a sequel coming up, so what better time than right now to tackle this game, I guess, so let's go. Let's play. Play the campaign or the following. Be the zombie? What the hell is that? Play custom map. Nah, let's just, for now, let's play the campaign. game normal hard or nightmare that's all the difficulties we got I'm gonna stick to normal HUD activated commence briefing Approaching Haran. data on the subject Kadir Suleiman a local political figure hired to maintain order after the outbreak his brother Hassan died in a disease-related incident before we were able to evacuate him. Suleiman blamed the GRE for Hassan's death. He stole a highly sensitive file which became his bargaining chip against the GRE, with instructions to publicize it if anything happened to him. Data on the subject. The stolen file. In 10 seconds. It details the incomplete process of synthesizing a cure for the virus. If implemented in its current state, the produced substance may be extremely toxic. Now. Also, the file contains full description of the Varian's structure. Any attempt to use it would result in countless lives lost. It must be recovered. Further information, current status. Suleiman sent the file to an associate unknown to us, with instructions to publicize it at his command at any time. To counter that, we instituted a citywide communication jam, preventing him from publicizing the file. Your GRE issued radio can overcome that jamming. It is your lifeline. Do not lose it. Suleiman has since gone underground and begun using a different name. We have reason to believe he now leads one of the two main factions operating within the city. You are to find Suleiman and locate the stolen file in order to save mankind from a disaster of unprecedented proportions. Holy shit, that is a huge dump of exposition right from the get-go. Anyway, it's about some guy called Suleiman and I'm to apprehend him. I told you that wasn't a normal uh -oh. drop shoot. Break his legs. Oh then no 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 wait wait guys! Back up! All of you! Stop! Loud noises draw them! Ow! How about I yell really loudly? Fall back! Fall back! You motherfucker! Okay, so the city is already infected. Um, I'm still not in control. Oh shit! I am still not in control. Okay, still a cutscene. Apparently, we are not here to stop a zombie outbreak. It, the outbreak has already happened. Tower, this is Jade. Get sick bed ready. Got a guy with a bad head wound. Wait, I got bitten? Oh shit, Amir's hurt? No, Amir is gone. But I'm bringing in someone who might still survive. One of us? We'll see.
Apparently, our operation didn't get all that prepared for the drop spot. You'd expect the mission to to go on smoothly for at least the first 10 minutes. Then something unexpected happens. Then we improvise, but no. No. The shit hits the fan from the very beginning. Okay, it's that kind of mission. I got it. You pinch him. You're scared. Not scared. And Ow! He blinked. What? He blinked again. What if he's a zombie? Ah! Zombie! The brains! Children's brains! <sighs> I received a new outfit. Go to my player stash to change into it. Player stash, would that be in the menu? I guess not. Hey, look at that. Ma. Hans 3 Is that supposed to be a movie? Alien zombie from Mars closer than you think <laughs> oh, well, I want to see that movie This is a very Detailed Indoor environment I guess Oh somebody was keeping count The Jade, the scorpion, Al, Alde Aldemir, what does that mean? Is this, is this, is this where I changed my outfit? Please, game, I don't know anything, oh, this is crouching. Is there a sprint button? Whoa, what the shit was that? What's that? Hello? Hey, tunes, let's dance. That's quite a book collection. You know, this seems a little too orderly. For someone living in a zombie apocalypse, but I guess that's the benefit of living in apartments. Like there are less ways to get in, so in a in an environment like this, it's actually safer than condos or villas. Hello there, children. You sleep for three days like a dead man and scare children? Off to a great start, 31. Where am I? In paradise, can't you see? Okay, enough joking around. Head to room 190. The boss? The boss? What do you mean, 31? Ask the boss. Boss. Well, I guess the boss is the one I have to shank to be the boss. Hey, children. Uh, are you still scared of me? 31. That's your number. Uh, why do I have a number? Oh, you're Selma. Thanks, thanks for telling me that, game. Excuse me? Your number. You're the 31st infected. I'm the 18th. Everything is counted here. One fewer doses of antizen. One more new infected. One more runner gone. Um... I'm already infected. Why haven't I turned? Why do Why do you still bother saving me? Hey, man. Oh, she's she's sick. Hello, Teddy. Would you talk to me? Yeah, man. People keep ignoring me. Hey, how about I play this with you? Huh? See, I I I can do this. Mm, I can't. 
My body is intangible. All right. Thirty-one. I'm gonna die because of this guy. Quiet. Hey, I'm right here. Now he's gonna get a meal, Santi. Uh, hello. You look. You have a daredevil look about you. You know that. Hey, where's room one ninety? Upstairs. I heard you guys have some problem with me. That's quite all right. I have a few problems with myself too. Maybe we can have problems with me together. You know. And you are Crane, uh, thirty-one. Oh, right. Um, how's your head? My head. Got it. Listen up. Until the boss says so, you are not on the list. So go talk to him ASAP and let's get things moving. Now, if you'll excuse. Hey! Don't slam the door in my face. Don't you know who I am? Actually, who am I? All right. Gotta walk. Gotta see the boss. Gotta see the boss. That's some um, lot of graffiti here. People are gonna be bored out of their mind if they're stuck in one building forever. Hello, Zafar. I'm looking for the boss. Is he in there? Oh, you're 31. What am I Go supposed to be famous? What is everyone? Everyone's heard of me. So, this is headquarters. Okay, thank you for the graffiti to point that out. I'm just gonna explore everywhere else. Kelly, what the hell is a hold up? Hello, guys. Hmm. Wait, a door I can open? Apparently not. It's just for tease. Hey, buddy, what are you doing? Are you a prisoner? It doesn't look like something you'd want a prisoner to have. Hey, man. Oh, I could just kick his butt and he'll fall out of the window. You wouldn't tell anyone, would you? Hi man, what are you writing? What are you keeping note? It's these posters again. This movie's gotta be popular. Hey, what sort of plan is this? I can't really understand their writings. Zombie bites! See something? Say something. Ah, <laughs> poor elephant. What? Who put up with this? Uh, tracked. Be quiet or you'll buy it! Glad the TV programs have kept their optimism. Boss! Oh, there's the boss. Boss is like looking, uh, looking over at the horizon with a binocular, just like a boss would do. Boss, you are so boss. Hey, I'm looking for the. Are you the boss? What, am I too young? You got a problem with my age? No, I... You wanted to talk to me? That's better. Do you remember anything? Know what you are? Yeah, I can, I can see this is some kind of shelter. We call it the Tower. Brecken and his runners put Whoa, it all together shit. a couple of months ago, and we've been here ever since. Hunting airdrops, scavenging, and rescuing people. Yeah, I, I wanted to thank that girl. Good, because if not for her, you'd already be chewing somebody's knee bone. Your antigen was totally crushed, by the way. Only thing Jade could salvage was your radio. Oh, great. So can I get that back, please? Actually, I think I need it more than you do. Believe me, pal, that's not the case. Fine. Take it. You know my runners put their lives in danger for guys like you. 
So now you take the antigen meant for someone else, and you won't even share your gear with us? I don't have time to deal with your bullshit. I've lost contact with one of our guys thanks to the fucked up radios we're stuck with. Do something for me, would you? I don't want to see you or your precious radio anymore. So go be useful somewhere else. Oh, man. We don't tolerate lazy assholes here in the tower. Hey, be fair. I'm not... I'm not lazy. I'm just... Hey, boss. Save it. That last guy I mentioned, he's only on the 13th floor. But he might as well be trapped in a mine cave -in. Come back later. Oh, man. Now I feel like shit. And I'm not the boss. Too young, remember? I'm Rahim. Brecken's in charge here. Okay, so you're not a boss. Um... But you have successfully made me feel like a useless part of the shit. So that's pretty bossy of you. I have a feeling Rahim and I will get along just fine. This Bracken guy? Ooh, you know those Brackens. Uh, well, a guy is lost on the 19th floor and they, these guys kind of saved my life. So I'd like to do something for them in return. I'm not lazy, you little shit. Check for the last arrival on the 13th. Okay, it's the 13th floor. This is why uh, I need game instructions, but I can't get in through here, can I? Hey, one. can you? What did the zombie say to his day? Just let me. Oh, ah. Dude, enough with the stupid jokes. There's gotta be a way up there. How did those guys get up? Hey, man. Could you, could you let me try this door? These people around here. Oh, you're not a prisoner. Where do you think you're going? 13th floor. I'm getting some stuff for Raheem. 13? Shit. That's gonna be some dirty work. But we all got to pull uh, our way around why? here. Why? Is there something I should know? Okay, I'm going downstairs instead. Uh, I can't. Fuck. Oh, you still have elevators? I, I didn't even expect that. Jesus. How many people died here? How many babies died here? At least there's not like a half true the baby remains here. That would be absolutely horrible. Crane here. Where were you? We've been waiting for your report. It's been over 70 hours. I lost my radio for a while. Don't worry, my cover's intact. No contact with the tower's leader yet. Unable to confirm identity and taking steps to blend in. Acknowledged. Time is of the essence, Crane. Remember that. There's, there's one more thing. I, I got bitten. I've shown no symptoms, but the people here say I'm infected. Then you'd better get your hands on some antisent ASAP. Help! Hadn't you? Help! Somebody! What the hell? Okay, this is where we learn how to use our weapons. And there's a jump button. How do I run? Oh, there's a kick. L3 to run. To sprint. Good. I'm gonna <laughs> kick some butts. Duck tape. Ooh -hoo. Um. To check you later, okay? Grateful I don't have a stamina meter. Nails. I can't see shit around this place. Alright, here here we go. Um nope. That's a nope for you. Why is, why is L1 and R2 
the attacking buttons. It's kind of weird, but I'm sure I will get used to it in due time. No TV. Holy shit! How the fuck did I do that? Uh, it's locked. No locked doors. Locked doors be locked doors. Ooh, this is not good. Even these quarantine tapes won't budge against my. What am I? What am I wielding here? Pipe. I cut my arm, getting away from him. Oh God, you had to kill him, didn't you? You God prefer that I talk it. to him? That was, that was my brother. I came down to see him and... Easy, easy. It's all right now. I'll, I'll get help. Hey, Raheem, this is Crane. I'm down here on 13. Listen, this guy of yours got fucked up pretty bad getting away from a zombie. Oh shit. 31? You went after Mark? Is it... is it safe down there? Yeah, well, it's safe enough now. Okay, don't move. I'm sending Lena downstairs. Take care of him. How do you want me to take care of him? Suck him? Hey, hold still. Lena will be here any minute. Goss! You've got to find some goss! Are you sure that's a cut and not a bite? Them. That will stop the bleeding. Please hurry! I try to stay calm, okay? I'll be right back. Uh, he doesn't look... He doesn't have that uh, painful expression on his face, so I'm, I'm assuming he's fine. Alright, let's do some scavenging. Oh, I have a torchlight? And my survivor sense. Oh shit, every game has something like this. Metal parts. Basically, this is my evil vision. You know, Assassin's Creed. You know, most or, or my uh, detective mode in Arkham games. You know, most games they actually have some canon explanation for these supernatural abilities. But I guess in this case it's just the survivor vision. Your survivor your surviving instincts. Which you have somehow managed to uh, harness at at will. Which is really convenient. Alcohol? And more dark. Why do why do you have so many duct tapes in this one place? And they're all inside some yellow crates this is highly suspicious it's suspicious okay I think that's everything I'm gonna find let's give this a uh, shot raft okay this is my crafting inventory I'm guessing I need to craft a med kit little craftsman I got a trophy Mark! Hang in there, buddy, I'm coming! <laughs> okay. So, let me just stick it there. Okay, who's hurt? He's bleeding pretty bad. Let me see him. Goes an alcohol, huh? Pretty primitive, but it'll work. Thanks for the help. I'll take care of him from here.
Well done, 31. You know, for all the horrible things and all that setup about this level 13, it's really just one zombie. It's not that bad. Hey, 31. Not bad for a new guy. Well, of course you did. You. Yeah, I just want to help out and repay you guys for what you did for me. Well, good. Come find me, and we'll talk about how you can do that. We're gonna have to choose a side. Don't we? Somewhere down the line, to go, to uh, stick to our mission or stay and help these guys. What was this? Hmm. Baby's car, wheelchair. What was this place originally used for? Hey, dude. All right, taken care of. Piece of cake. What else you got for me? Well, let me think. Rahim, you are just smart enough to be dangerous, you know that? Omar told me about your plans for the nest. Explosive charges? Really? What? Explosives? Oh, I never please. said that. You can't tell a convincing lie to save your life. I know what I'm doing. Yeah? You think you can't die? You're not my mom. No, I'm not. Our mom's dead. So you might want to be a little nicer to me since I'm the only family you have left. Especially now that Amir is gone. You're Jade, right? Right. I just wanted to thank you for what you did for me and, and tell you how sorry I am for your loss. I owe you and Amir my life. Yeah, you do. You want to return the favor? Keep my dipshit brother from killing himself. No explosives, Rahim. Oh, I still have the flashlight on. Well, I don't mind being your love interest in this game, by the way. Okay. I'm just gonna be weird and not address you. And come here to look at the view. It's pretty impressive. I wonder if I can actually go to these places. How big is the map? Do I have a map? Map not all available. Okay. Let's talk to you about the map. So, so, is that enough? Do I get to talk to Brecken now? First, go change your clothes. I left some new ones for you in your room. You're in 194. Something wrong with what I'm wearing? You need something that fits the job Brecken wants you to do. Call me when you've changed. So he has a job for me. Big what? Big guy wants has a job for me. Hmm. I am most flattered. One ninety four. Really? I have a room now? Or is it just a room that I woke up from? Hey dude, what are you doing in my room? Well, I guess it's a shared room. Is that supposed to be for me? And it's like it's gift wrapped. This is your player stash. You can change clothes here as well as leave any items for storage. As your survivor rank increases, you will get access for new outfits. Cool. Alright, change into some fresh clothes. What was I originally wearing anyway? Okay, Raheem, I'm ready. Where do I find Brecken? Not so fast, 31. If you're going to earn your keep, we have to find out if you've got the skills. So get your ass up to the gym. It's on the top floor. Just a couple so plates I'm up. guessing it's tutorial? Okay. Nope, not from here. Hey, I got the skill. I got the moves. I got the power. Hey man, technician? Or are you looking for rats? 
I heard rats is a very popular apocalyptic food source. Hey, dude, what are you eating? That looks disturbing. This is somebody else's stash. Can I take a look? No, my stash is better. Oh, he finished up. What is he gonna do? I, I kind of want to follow him. He's just gonna. Oh shit! Keep it up, buddy. Hey, kids. See, I'm not a zombie. There's no need to be afraid. Oh, you're playing toy train. Can I play with you? Are those electrical or just wood carved? Yeah, it don't seem like electrical trains to me. That's too bad. And wow, push up is a very popular exercise around here. Hey man. What you doing? That looks dangerous. Shouldn't you be wearing a mask? Oh well. Here we go. Meeting the real boss now. Raheem, I don't see you. Where are you? Boss. Um. What the hell? Oh, Get this is here. a little test. Press and hold R1 to jump and grab the ledge. Remember to look R. Look right at your ledge you want to grab. Okay. <laughs> I think this is gonna be too difficult for me. Home. A crane on a crane. Ha <laughs> ha! You're so funny, Rahim. Oh, uh, what are you asking me to do here? Oh man. Okay, I'll play your little game. I'm not even looking down! Woohoo! I am badass! Welcome to our gym. First things first, you've got to learn how to run. What do you mean, learn how to run? Just do what I say, alright? Now, jump down to the very bottom. Uh, what do you mean? Uh, uh, Were you nuts? I'd kill myself. Don't be a wimp. Oh, come on, you can't be serious. Watch this. Are we doing leap of faith now? Ah, ah, Raheem! My leg! Jesus, don't move! I'll get help! Ha! I was just fucking with you! Son of a bitch! What? You can't take a joke? Come on! Get your ass down here! Christ on a crutch. <laughs> okay, never heard that saying before. But here we go. Uh, you can do this, man. You've played like every single main line in the Assassin's Creed games. You, you got this. Where the hell? How did he survive anyway? <sighs> Keep an open mind. This is just a game. Here we go! Holy shit! Holy shit! It's a rush, isn't it? But don't blow your load just yet. There's more. To survive outside, you got to take advantage of the terrain. Most eaters suck at climbing, so the harder the terrain is, the better for you. I've got some typical situations set up for you. Let's see how you handle them. Most the eaters. You mean typical zombies? Bitey ones? Oh, 
on. How about we jump this one next time? Sometimes it's better to crawl through the low narrow passages. Ethers will have a tough time following you. I wonder if I can let's see this. Ah uh, no. Uh, Rahim. Hmm. This should be no problem. Try not to slow down once you start running. Outside, if you stop, you're probably dead. I got this. Woohoo! Um, don't release the jump button while jumping, otherwise you won't grab. It. Well, thank you for telling me this mid-air, cause I already let go of the button, you dick. This comes from the message that says you shouldn't stop running. The game is being a dick. Not bad for a noob. Okay. Um. What did I just do? Press and jump. Grab the ledge you're looking at. Well, that's what I did. <laughs> All right, get up on that scaffold and don't fall, because there sure as hell ain't no net. That's my favorite. Cat grab and muscle up. You won't survive outside for ten minutes if you can't do that. Say what now? I'm sorry, what are we doing? Oh. Just a little climbing. It's no big deal. Nathan Drake does it all the time, although not in first person mode. Alright, this is. I think this is where I'm going. Good job. Okay, time for the real test. Get back to the crane. Make use of anything and everything while you run. Okay. Yeah, I think the game is still kind of holding my hand on this one. Can I climb this a little bit faster? Probably not. <laughs> okay. closest I ever came to this was running track in high school. Huh. Well then you're a fucking prodigy. Never seen anything like it. He's actually saying nice things about me. That's pretty nice for a change. Okay, I'm gonna get to that ledge. Is he on the other side of this thing? He is, isn't he? 
I gotta run back to him now. Fine. That's how he wants to play it. What, what the hell? What is happening to me? Oh shit, my bite! Shit. Talk to me. What's going on? Something went wrong. Raheem. I need my medicine. Oh shit. I bet you're having your first seizure. Just get back over here. I'm kinda in the middle of something. Uh right here, buddy. Oh, there you are. Hey, we need to talk. Raheem, what the fuck was that? Does this mean I'm I'm turning? Most likely no. At least not yet. Caesars reminds you that you're infected. You better go see Dr. Zera, though. He'll check you out, probably give you a shot of antizin. Before you head out to see Zera, talk to the quartermaster. He'll uh, gear you up so you can go outside without getting your head bitten off. Well, thank you. That's very encouraging. Hey, we are going to have to go see the doctor. A zombie during the winter. I don't know, and I don't want to know. Try guessing. Some kind of winter infection? Frostbite. Oh, I get it. Ah, uh, the guy on the wheelchair is like, please let me die. Just give me a quick death. Hey, man. Are you eating the same disgusting thing as everybody else? Uh, just turn the light off. You don't really need. Uh, I better go see the doctor and get my arm checked out. Maybe I'm turning. Maybe I will become a zombie. I'll be a parkouring zombie. That's gotta be the most terrifying thing anyone's ever heard of. What's going on? Alright, they've given me an actual job, and nobody suspects I'm not who I say I am. So far so good. And once Dr. Zara helps me manage these symptoms I'm dealing with, I'll be even better. Where is this Dr. Ziri? Oh, you're the new scout. Rahim radioed me about you. Yeah, that's me. Name's Crane. I'm not gonna bother learning your name till you survive a few days, but here, this is for you. Okay. By the way, Word around the tower is you're just another deadbeat in line for food or antizen. By which I mean, the people here don't much like you. But don't blame them. It's easy to get paranoid when you're isolated. And since somebody's jamming communications to the outside, there's plenty of paranoia to go around. Whole damn city with nobody to call for help but ourselves. You bring me some supplies from the airdrops, though. And you'll see people change their tunes in a hurry. That shit's a game changer. Uh, thanks. I'll bear that in mind. Listen, is there anything else? I'm in a bit of a rush. Also, if you're looking to get more popular, you can try helping folks. Do a few favors, they might like you more. Might even find a woman. Keep you warm at night. <laughs> Thank you for your advice. I'll take them into consideration. Oh, a water pipe. I guess that's an upgrade from what I got. Oh, I have to take them. He's not charging me, but I suspect it's only for this time. Lockpick, mad kick, metal parts.
There it is. Marvin Zucker's Battle Journal. If you're reading this, I might be dead. I hope I'm not. Of course, but I have to tell you, things don't look too rosy in good old Hiram these days, especially for a scrawny bookish type like yours truly. I got all excited when the letter came, telling me I'd received a fellowship to the university here. Now, not so excited. All I wanted to do was get my degree and finish my latest novel. And writing is not just a hobby, Mom. It's what I'm doing to do. It's what I'm going to do for the rest of my life. I don't think self-publishing 19 science fiction novels in two years is something you do if you're not serious. Holy shit, that's pretty impressive. Anyway, I'm sort of figuring out how to survive in here, and as I do, I'll record it all in these pages. So if you're finding this stuff and I'm not around, well, I hope you have better luck than I did. He's taking it pretty good. Side, never let them surround you. Hey, oh, what do you do here? You know, for an organization that claims that everyone needs to be doing something to earn their keep, there sure is a whole bunch of people seemingly doing nothing. Just saying, just an observation. What is this symbol on the map? Oh, pick up bounty. Collect 50 requisition packs. Go to the entrance of underground parking in slums. It's probably not too hard. Um, hello, people. Well, unless you unless you're telling me I can just go do my side quest already. I don't think so. No, I think that's for later. I'm just have to progress it a little bit further. Leaving safe zone. Well, that's that's my intention. Hey. Okay, new guy. Be careful out there. We've lost too many already. Oh, thank you for your concern, man. <laughs> okay, noob. You've got Doctor Zera set up in a semi-trailer on a fenced-in plane court. When you leave the tower, hang a left and head due south. You can't miss it. It's Crane, kid. All right, all right. Crane. Just keep moving. There's no time to take in the sights. And try not to make too much noise. Sound attracts those fuckers. Why would you have your doctor set up anywhere else but your headquarters? Oh, those birds look pretty cool. Uh, I guess I can go check out a side quest first. Can I use the map now? Please, game. Thank you. Where is the side quest? Holy shit, it's so far away. Or is it far away? I, I don't know. I don't... I don't have a lot of concept for it yet. Gotta find a way to get around. It is it it pays to learn to know how to oh shit pa how to parkour in in a zombie apocalypse. Really gets you around. Oh shit. Search dead bodies for loot. Yeah, not gonna happen this time. They can't climb, can they? Oh shit! Wrong button. It's okay. I totally got this!
What do you have for me? Metal parts? Sure. Uh, it's clear there are a lot of scavenging to do in this game. I gotta say, parkour in this game feels pretty awesome. Oh shit. <laughs> Weapons ineffective? Oh shit, this thing needs repairing? I got some cigarettes. Well, I hope. Maybe they use cigarettes as currency, like they do in prison. But why is cigarette <laughs> such a popular currency in prison anyway? How did it come to be? And it's not even just one prison, it's like all over the world. It doesn't even matter if you're if you're a smoker or not. I, I think these zombies aren't very fast, so I guess I can afford to take a few liberties here and there. Yes, I know I should go to see the doctor, but come on, it's an open world game. Alcohol, however. Oh, I just ate it. I guess I don't get to keep it. But I'm not hurt, man. Back, back level consumable. Did I just eat it too? How about you keep some? Craft part. I can craft an item. I wonder. Yeah, the only thing I can get is mad kit but i guess that's pretty useful too it's health <laughs> hmm. gotta learn to get around Oh shit. How about I just make a run for it? Oh, I got some money. Oh yeah. That just scratched my theory about a cigarettes being currency. They actually use money. Valuable item. I hope. Oh, sh shit balls. Um. My decision to just to run for it is seems to be taking some sort of consequence. That's okay, yeah. I'm, uh, I know where I'm going. I know what I'm doing. Okay, this is maybe a pretty shitty idea. <laughs> oh! Pick a lock. Sure, I know how to pick a lock. A lot of games do this. Ah, oh, shit! I only have one! I can create more lockpicks using... <laughs> Alright! I'm 
a string. Whatever that's gonna do. Oh sh God damn it. I'm about to die! <laughs> really love the parkour system. Very interactive, very sensitive too. Like very empowering. What the hell? I'm not afraid of these zombies at all. Hey man. Cost me some health. I'm good. I know it's probably not to the best of viewing experiences that I only park for a few seconds, then I stop and stare, look around, searching for items. Well, I, I kind of do have to look for items and I just really want to take in. I'm still very new to the game. I want to see all the little stuff. Bye. Damn it, I thought there were no zombies here, around here. A lockpick for for a van? An ambulance? Is is that at in any way plausible? Has anyone ever used a simple lockpick to open an ambulance? Well, I doubt anyone ever tried to. So I don't think Spike, it's Crane. There's a building here covered in quarantine tape. You know what it is? I sure do. You are looking at the original quarantine ground zero. The first infected were moved there from the hospitals when the outbreak started. Things fell apart pretty quick, and the building was abandoned. It's chock full of biters, but it's also chock full of supplies. Even Rise's people haven't been able to crack it. Okay. I don't think I'm quite ready for it though. Hey viewers, this is a little additional note that I'm adding to the video during editing. Apparently Spike is a character that we haven't actually met yet. But because I strayed away from the main mission and decided to go adventure around, I chanced upon this place and it triggered this conversation with Spike, which I guess 
uh, is something that's going to be the norm in future encounters, but this sh probably shouldn't have happened yet. So a little bit of mistake on the game's part. There, keep enjoying the video. Has anyone claimed this place yet? Hmm, I wonder what's up there. Oh, come on. It won't let me climb. But I really want to. Oh, well. What is this? Go to the entrance of the underground. What, I already completed it? I just have to go to the entrance? I don't have to do anything about it? Hello? Anybody there? Camden, are you there? Damn it. Uh, so I'm supposed to get a vaccine? What? No, no. Suppressant. It's called Antizen. Suppresses the symptoms here. Sit. Antizen postpones the inevitable. Best the GRE could do. Inevitable? So, so there's no cure? It's a variation of rabies. There's no cure right now, but you see, I've been running tests on both antizen and infected tissue. A cure is possible, definitely possible. Oh shit, you really think you can figure it out? With Dr. Camden's help, yes, I think so. Uh, now where did I put that injector? And who's Dr. Camden? A colleague trapped in Sector Zero, where the outbreak first, well, broke out. We've been collaborating via radio, though we would have made more progress if the connection were better. Also, if my earlier experiments had borne fruit, I tried injecting recombined versions of the virus into chunks of meat and leaving them around the city, hoping some of the infected would eat them so I could observe and document the results. But they didn't? Uh, it bore no fruit. I'm ashamed that I wasted so much time on it. No reason to hold any antizen in reserve now. In any case... All right. I'm quite busy, so on your way now. What was I doing? Doctor seems a bit forgetful. Speed keeps you alive. So don't Raheem, Zara checked me out and gave me another shot. Okay, great. Not enough to hold you. For a while. Which is good, because I'm starting to get used to the idea of bossing you around. So, hey. time for a real trial. That. Go talk to Spike. You'll find him near Zara's truck. He's got the first real job for you. Alright, my real job, look at that. Like a real deal now. 